Welcome again to another video on Webcraft. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can easily make money in 2025. Now, as the year starts, maybe you are looking for ways to sell your products or digital products online. I'm here to show you a way that you can sell your digital products without spending a dime or hiring any web developer to develop an e-commerce store for you. So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can easily leverage the Paystack platform to easily sell your digital product without any cost to you at all. And this will also enable you to sell the product on any other platform, whether it's your blog or any platform that you are on, even on social media. So without wasting any time, let's jump into the video. So the first thing obviously that you need to do is to go to paystack.com. Now you will be met with this interface where you have to create an account if you don't already have an account. So if you do not have an account, go ahead and click on create free account. And the panel will open up for you to fill your details so that your account will be quickly created for you. Now, as you know, Paystack is a payment gateway that allows businesses to take payments um, through mobile money or through Visa or MasterCard. And it's a very seamless way uh, most businesses in Africa are able to transact businesses or able to collect payments from their clients or from other businesses that you do business with. So go ahead and create your account and then we'll move on to the next step. Now, after your account is created, you'll be brought to this dashboard. Now, sometimes creating the account on Paystack takes a while for your account to be approved for you to be able to use um, this platform. So the first you need to make sure that at the top right corner over here, you have the toggle banner indicating live over here. This means that you are now ready to be able to take payment. So please make sure that this button is actually um, gone live so that you'll be able to take payment and you'll be able to accept um, any type of payment on this platform. So once that is done, what we want to do first is to create a product. So to create a product, click on under commerce, you need to click on product in here. And as you can see, I have to um, digital products listed in here and when you click on one of them you can see details about this product you can see the number of orders i've not been able to sell any um, any yet but if you go on preview you can actually see what people will be seeing when they actually click on a link of this digital product so i have the cover of the digital product in here you can put in more pictures if you want for people to see, get a preview of how um, what they are to expect when they download this digital magazine. In here, you have details about the magazine and then the price. So once the person clicks on buy, they are able to put in their first name, last name, email address, phone number. And then once that is okay, they can review and then go ahead and make payment. So let me show you how I created this digital product. So the first thing we need to do, as I said, is to create products. So let's go ahead and click on products again and then go to new products. So in here, I'm going to put in my uh, product name. The next thing will be the product description. So you need to put in some description about your product in here. And then you go ahead and set the price of your product. Now, if this is a physical good, then you will be um, required to keep stock of the amount. But this is actually a digital product we are creating. So make sure that so this product contains one or more physical goods. If it does not, then don't um, toggle this uh, uh, button over here. So this is a, a, a digital product, so we don't um, toggle this um, button here. So now go to next. So this is where I can add images about my digital products I'm selling. So if you have images about your digital product, you can go ahead and click on add new and then you'll be brought here where you can actually click and then add several images of your product. So you can add as many as six high quality images in here. They can also be GIFs or videos as well. So let me add just three of them. So let me add two more. Okay, so let's just wait for it to upload. So once they are uploaded, then I can go on and go to save. So once I'm on save, it means I've been able to create my first product. 
but this product is not a digital product yet we need to actually tell paste that this is a digital product we are selling so we need to just beside on the product info go to digital downloads and then you need to add your files here so customers who purchase this product will be able to download the uploaded files so upload up to 10 files and the maximum that you can do is 4 gig each so let's go ahead and down and add our files so if you have a pdf of your document then you can go ahead and add the document in here so it will take a while for it to upload here just wait a second for it to finish so as you can see in here our file is now uh, nicely uploaded in here so people can actually now get the file when they actually after they've made payment for this digital product now you can also set an expiry for the download links uh, which i'll not do for now but if it's an option that you want that is after the person buys the product the link that they use to download this product uh, will expire after um, a number of days that you specify um, our product is now ready let's preview this so you can see the images we put in here are now nicely showing over here and we have a product name the a description about the product and then the amount that um, the product is going for so once per somebody clicks on buy they will be required to put in their name so let's just put some names in here and let's see uh, how the um, process is so i have my email address my phone number you select the country you put in your phone number and once you do that you can go ahead and click on review and pay so let me put in the phone number again so go to review once you're okay with the details you can go ahead and click on pay so it says invalid phone number okay let's go back and edit that If you will pay so once everything is okay now we brought in here where we can now make payment so if i want to pay with mobile money i'll just enter in my uh, my phone number and then the provider that i'm using if it's a visa card that i want to use mastercard i also put in um, these details and i can even save my card so that in the future if i'm buying from the same person i don't need to put in my card details again so you get a flow of how everything works in here there are a couple of um, features that you can also add to this if you go on to the inventory section you can actually edit the inventory and maybe if there's a limited stock to this you can put it put that in here um, if there's a low stock alert um, but this is a digital product so we don't need to do that so let's go to cancel you can also customize the product in here um, if there are any discounts that you want to offer to your clients or customers you can also put in the discount code that they can use to uh, purchase this product and um, delivery this is disabled again this is a digital product after purchase you also want to be able to um, customize the message that your clients will see after they purchase so if after they buy from you you want to redirect them to uh, um, another page or, or thank them for their purchase you can also do that in a success message um, if you want to send a notification so it says we'll send an email alert for every new order not all team members can create and manage product already this. so if you want to get a notification so somebody buys you can put in um, a message in here and that message will be sent to your email address now this is a, a split payment so split payment has to do with creating maybe you are splitting this money with another person you can create a sub account for that person whereby when the money comes in the amount to be automatically split between you maybe and the person who uh, maybe built um, this um, this uh, um, magazine or the digital product that you are selling that is if you are selling it on behalf of someone else so 
after this is done now you can get a link so if you go up here and you say copy link this means that wherever you put in this link if you put in, in you put it into your web browser any web browser now the person will just go straight ahead and make payment you can share it to somebody on whatsapp you can share it on your social media platform so for example i have um, a google um, a google site in here which i created for free you can also do same i have a video up here actually that shows you how to create or link your digital products to your google sites for free so as you can see here I've, i just put in this image in here i just put in a button underneath and underneath it where i can say um buy now so the only thing i need to do is just um, add this paste tag link in here and click on update so if i save this and i go to the website just refresh this so if i save this and i go to the website let's get a preview of this okay so once i see this and i want to buy once i click on buy now you can see it brings you right again to this uh, digital product where i can easily go ahead and make payments for the products so that's it this is a very easy way you can create your own or you can sell your digital products you can upload as many digital products as you want you can use this to sell ebooks you can use it to sell videos you can use it to sell audio files as well and it does not cost you anything or it does not cost you the money of going to hire a web developer or somebody to spend some weeks or months to develop an e-commerce store for you so the only charge to you is that paystack actually charges to you between 1.95 and 2 percent for each transaction that you do on this platform which is nothing compared to the number of sales that you can make using this method so if this is something that was really helpful to you please don't forget to like this video and also subscribe to the channel because every week i put out content on payment gateways and website development that i know will go a long way to help you build your skill and also boost your business thank you for joining me and i hope to see you in the next video